Welcome back to Good Morning Cleveland on News 5. We are back at 630. A critical link to downtown Akron is about to be under construction. It's a project years in the making, finally about to break ground. Work is about to begin on the abandoned Akron and Barberton Belt, aimed at making a new hiking and biking trail connecting downtown Summit Lake and even the university campus. It's going to be amazing. So cool when this is done. It'll be known as the Rubber City Heritage Trail. Love its name too. John Rudder live with the details on this one. Hi, John. Hey, good morning, Katie. Good morning, Danito. Well, Akron has seen a steady increase in cyclists over the years, so naturally the city has been adding things like bike trails and various bike lanes. Now the Rubber City Heritage Trail will help provide a critical link to, uh, to connect Eastsiders to downtown. From rails to trails. The city's certainly trying to grow our bicycle network. The city of Akron is putting the finishing touches on the first phase of the Rubber City Heritage Trail. It's got a long 800 foot like old railroad trestle bridge that we're converting over, um, you know, to a bikeway bridge. The trail is being designed in phases as funding becomes available. Phase one will cost about $2 million, with roughly 700000 of that price tag coming in federal funding. Once you start a phase, then in theory, it should be easier to get uh, funding to connect to an existing trail. The six mile path connects Akron's eastern suburbs with the heart of downtown and the University of Akron, with the first phase just under a mile in length, beginning near the site of the former Goodyear complex. It'll give us a good opportunity to, you know, explain the history of all the rubber companies and, you know, do some on trail um, amenities that, you know, people could stop and see the history of how, you know, the rubber industry changed Akron. Part of that phase includes the former Akron Barberton Belt Elevated Railway Corridor, a 10 foot wide pathway that will accommodate both hikers and bikers. Railroad bridges are always built like tanks, you know, so we never usually worry about, you know, will it hold the bike, you know, but it's just, it's not pedestrian friendly at all. The Rubber City Heritage Trail offers Akron residents a unique way to commute around the city as biking grows in popularity as a mode of transportation. We're trying to do a lot of road diets now where we add bike lanes in to, you know, underutilized pavement widths. Now, this is just one of about nine of these phases that will be developed over the next eight to ten years. The first segment construction is expected to start sometime this fall. Danita. All right, thank you, John.